The first digital TV converter boxes have hit stores. These are the boxes you're going to need next year if you receive your TV over the air using an indoor antenna, often called a rabbit ear antenna or an outdoor antenna. Come February, the analog broadcast that these antennas receive will disappear. No more picture unless you have one of these converter boxes. The boxes will do more, however, than save you from having no TV. They'll also improve your picture quality. This is what an analog station looks like in New York. And this is what the same station looks like in digital. Much better, right? But there's a peculiar problem that comes along with getting digital signals on an older analog TV. That's because the digital signals are formatted widescreen. And when they show up on an analog TV, you often get black bars. In this case, we're getting window boxing all around, black bars all around. Otherwise, you might get letterboxing. The converters can deal with this um, through a zoom function that will let you magnify the picture. But you may be hitting that zoom button from show to show just to make the uh, picture look good on all shows. So that's a problem to watch out for. Now, if you're a cable or satellite subscriber, you don't need one of these boxes. Your service will keep working after February next year. But you still might be tempted by one of these. If you've been getting cable and satellite mostly because over-the-air picture quality has been bad, these converter boxes may well solve your problem. And you can't fault the price. They cost $60, but the government will give you a $40 coupon, so the final cost is just $20. And there's no subscription fee, of course. For AP, I'm Peter Svensson.